welcome guys yesterday's daily commitment was crazy man just a couple of pull-ups and a couple of push-ups mostly stretching I did because I was exhausted after working a physical job all day so if you work a physical job all day you don't need daily commitment right this is for just being a computer or DoorDash driver or whatever anyway I hate this angle there is I'd like to see the uh, the Sun on me but I guess it depends when you're back here it darkens everything up anyway so a little stretching here is good we're definitely feeling it still on our left elbow, that same injury we've had. But I like this, it's a great way to start, man. Just a little stretching. A little stretching is a good way to start in everything. As longer I've had this channel, the longer I've realized those guys who say stretching is good, they, got, they really got something. Can really do a lot of your health just by doing certain stretches every day will really change your health. Um, but you do want to do some working out and that's what we're going to do. Again, we're going to use these guys. They take about 17 pounds off this pull-up. We can do a pull-up without them. We've got three as our, our record without the helper bees. But we've gotten up to eight here. One, two, three, four, five. I think we're just going to stick with five. I'm still feeling that soreness in my left elbow, so I don't want to push that too hard, but we'll take five. We'll take five. We're doing them every day now. This elbow, it's this right, it's right in here, right in here that gets sore. Anyway, we want to do some push-ups. The push-ups, we've really lowered the amounts of push-ups we're doing. Our push-up total is really low right now. We've only been doing like five, six, seven push-ups. Again, Two sets of 13 is our max, which is way more than that. I'm gonna do an angle here a little bit, just so we can just make sure that body's straight. When I come down, I really wanna make sure I keep those shoulders down. Two, three, and I definitely have that shoulder injury still. Four, so we're not gonna kill ourselves and do too many. Five, we're just gonna do five, like we've been doing. And we're gonna focus on the stretching. So I'm going right into downward dog here. So it's not the elbow that's injured with these guys. It's the top of this left shoulder right here. Top of this left shoulder. So again, we're gonna keep those exercises low. We're gonna focus on doing the stretching. Tomorrow we're gonna stretch every day. We're gonna heal up, man. But we're gonna keep the daily commitment going. Cause for me, it's a lot easier to just exercise every day, even if it's a small amount, rather than taking days off. I'd rather do less exercises more often seems to work better for me i've tried a lot of different things rotating exercises and daily commitment but i really just like doing that little bit every day it adds up over time it adds up your competency really increases with these push-ups when i was first doing i had my hands way out here and was doing them all weird and wrong then i started getting a good form but my shoulders would come up like this because i didn't have the strength to hold them in the right position but if i let them kind of go up like that i could lock and get a couple extra push-ups out but we're not doing it anymore we're trying to hold them down Get those good reps we're gonna get it going on that so now the squats squats are our best exercise I've done as many as a hundred squats uh, two days ago or three days ago yeah three days ago we did 70 squats which we used to always hit 70 squats we had like a three days in a row over 80 uh, at the end of last year but lately we haven't been hitting that a lot and that's partly again because of all that extra physical work we've been doing these pants I'm wearing as well they don't really they don't really go out wide very well. I'll pull them up here. Everybody likes the sexy legs. So, go ahead and, there we go, now they don't bind. We're gonna try to do a good number here again. We were putting insulation up all day yesterday and we finished it today. So I was still crawling under a house. So I'm not gonna try to do a million of these. I think, what are we at, five? But let's wear ourselves out at least a little bit six this bars to keep her back straight seven sometimes we do do the weighted squats eight nine but not today ten we're just gonna settle in for a long winter's nap eleven doing squats and wearing ourselves out twelve thirteen 14, 15, yesterday I did stretch squats, 16, 
I worked 12 hours yesterday. 17. There's no way I was doing my regular squats. 18. 19. Let's do 20 regular squats here. 20. I'm gonna do some of these stretch squats. You start with this elephant walk. This is the first, my first stretch exercise that I'm really started getting into. And I can get down about to here. Can't tw quite touch my, my palms, but I can get my fingers all the way down like that. And if you come down like this, turn this into a squat. And then you can come up, and now it's right back to a stretch. So the nice thing about these is it's a little bit less weight that you're squatting because you're not you're not carrying your torso up so a little easier from a whatchamacallit perspective from a muscular perspective so I'm gonna give myself kind of a break on those but they're great from a stretching perspective you're really linking your whole body together here you can feel the tightness when I'm right here so I'm gonna wait a minute for that stretch to kick in a minute and notice my hands are because I'm doing these look I can almost touch my palms so I'm actually increasing my flexibility here wow wow my knees aren't quite straight but there if I do that thing come straight we're getting close guys we're getting close to the full flexibility on these guys so I really like this new one definitely on a day when I've been doing a lot of physical labor this is an easier squat but it's more of a stretch squat. This is my new thing, man. My new thing to make it a little easier on my body. Again, just like that, right into the stretch. Anyway, guys, keep it up. A little bit of exercise every day. Doesn't matter what you do, just pick any exercise and start. And you're gonna be doing something good for yourself every day. Your psychology is gonna respond to this. And once you start doing something good for yourself exercise-wise every day, your body's gonna be like, yeah, I'm, I'm proud of myself. And then you can start increasing the amount. Increase slowly, don't get injured. It's all gonna work out. Daily commitment, guys, keep it going. All right, we'll see you guys next time, bye-bye.